Hey everybody, thanks for stopping by Smoking Steve's. Nope, we're not grilling up anything out there on the grill or smoking anything up on the smoker. We're going to be fixing some ice cream today on the Ninja Creamy. And it's going to be some fresh strawberry ice cream. Uh, we stopped at a place here in town in Venice, Florida called Detweiler's Farmer's Market. And uh, they had flats of strawberries for $7.99 a flat. And uh, we picked this up a flat and we got strawberries running out our ears. And uh, we got them here sitting on the counter all cut up and everything. I wish you could smell them. They're really smelling good. But anyway, we're going to make up some fresh strawberry ice cream and the Ninja Creamy. And we're going to get this thing all prepped up for the freezer. And uh, then we'll be pulling it out tomorrow and uh, mixing that uh, ice cream up. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, uh, back here in the background you can see all the strawberries laying out and there's our Ninja container. That happens to be the 24 ounce container and if you happen to have the uh, 16 ounce container uh, I'll give you those measurements as well. But what we're going to do is start out with a, a cup and a half of uh, fresh strawberries. half a cup of granulated sugar, a cup of heavy cream, one tablespoon of vanilla instant pudding, and then we got some uh, vanilla bean paste that we're going to use, uh, one teaspoon of that and uh, that will be for our 24 ounce and what we'll do is uh, get all that mixed up in our bowl and pour that in our container and then uh, top it off with our whole milk and bring it up to the full level so let's go ahead and get started okay guys i got my little immersion blender here uh, we're going to get these strawberries all mixed up and uh, if you don't have one of these they come in handy and they really work well so uh, let's go ahead and get these going. I wish you could smell this. Now you don't have to get it perfect. It's okay if you got a few chunks in there. No big deal. So we're going to call that good. Okay, got everything else dumped in the container now. So uh, let's get all this mixed up and ready to go. Okay, that's going to do it for our mix. Let's see, uh, I'm going to take a look and see how many ounces we got. Okay guys, uh, we're at about 24 ounces without adding any milk, but uh, I may add a splash just to bring it up a little bit. But uh, what you want to do, go ahead and get your little taste now, because now's the time to taste it where you can still make changes. Wow, that's really going to be good. Really going to be good. So I'm going to go ahead and add a touch of milk and bring that level up just a little bit. Then I'll be pouring it in the container. Okay, we came up a little short on our max fill. So I'm going to, add, going to go ahead and add uh, milk and bring it up to that level. And then we should be good to go for the freezer. Okay, so we added that splash of milk. Got it up to the uh, max fill level. Now we're going to just give it a little stir. 
get that mixed up. Then we'll be putting the lid on and we'll put it in the freezer for 24 hours. And then we'll be having some awesome fresh strawberry ice cream. Yeah, shoot, while well, I got that on the spoon, I might as well have another taste, right? Okay, guys, that 24 hours is up. I got that strawberry ice cream pulled in here out of the freezer. And we're ready to make some ice cream on this Ninja Creamy Deluxe. Uh, the guys, uh, it's getting a little close to uh, Easter. Uh, it's right around the corner. And uh, a couple videos ago, uh, I made a, a cherry glazed double smoked spiral ham. And uh, there's a link up above here. You can check that out. Uh, maybe it's something you want to do for Easter or just any old time, but check the, check out the video. I think you're really gonna like it. But that's to get this uh, strawberry ice cream going, and uh, I can't wait to do the taste test. I think it's really gonna be good. Okay, here's what she looks like. I don't know whether you can see it or not, but there's a little hump right here in the middle. We're gonna take a spoon and uh, knock that hump down and make that completely level. Okay, here it is after it's all leveled out with the spoon. So we're going to get that put in our uh, Ninja container here and get this baby all fired up. Just a matter of dropping that in the uh, Ninja container, putting the lid on, giving it a little spin, locking it in place, shove her in the Ninja, give her a twist, power on right here. And we're going to select full, and it's going to take about two minutes. And we're setting on ice cream right here, and hit the go button. So after about two minutes, uh, we'll pop that out and take a look at it. Uh, chances are it's going to be a little crumbly, it normally is, but uh, I'll show you what you got to do. Okay, she just shut down. Let's go ahead and take that lid off, see what she looks like. Uh, just as I thought, a little crumbly. So what we're going to do is add a little milk to the top, and we'll be doing a respin. Okay, add a little milk to it. Just a matter of putting that lid back on. Locking her in place, sliding her in. Select full and hit respin. Two more minutes and we should have some good ice cream. Okay, I got pulled out after the respin. Let's go ahead and pop this lid off. Oh wow, look at that. That's really creamy. We're going to go ahead and uh, put some in a bowl and be doing a taste test. Look at this. This is really looking good. Nice and creamy. So let's go ahead and get some put in a bowl. Oh, look at this. Mmm, mmm, mmm. We're going to go ahead and put a little whipped cream on top of that. I'm going to give her a taste test. Okay, I'm going to get me a little bit right here. A little whipped cream. A little strawberry ice cream. We're going in. Mm. Oh, that is really good. Really, really good. I'm going in for some more. Yum, yum. So good. Those fresh strawberries. This is good stuff, guys. Be sure to give this a try. Uh, I think you'll really enjoy it. Uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I hope to see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.